Welcome, everyone, to Topic Wonders. I am your host, Matrix Lord 212, and I'm with Scott. What's up, Scott? Deja vu all over again. What's up, Philip? Oh, yo. So this, this brings us to this Topic Wonders thing I couldn't wait to talk about since late last night when I saw the article. Remember I was saying, Scott, that I like to have the physical copy of yeah. things. I yeah. do not believe in the digital. I'm against the digital, right? Yeah. Guess what? Well, now, you buy anything that's digital, let's say from Apple, right? Yeah. Apple is starting to delete people's shit that is a purchase from a digital because you don't own it. It's like yeah. you're renting it or leasing it. Ooh. So you could be spending money like a full price for the digital copy. Yeah. And then all of a sudden in your library, it's gone. This happened to a person that three of his movies were gone. He flipped out, Ooh. made a big stink, and they were trying to, they wouldn't compromise. They were trying to give him three months of this or some stupid shit. Yeah. Lo and behold, the moral to the story is get your actual physical copies because you'll have it forever. Yeah. Digital is not forever. They can go into your shit and delete it. Ooh. I mean, I had, I remember I had purchased on iTunes Doctor Who stuff. I pop it in or walk yeah. Dead stuff, and I have a physical copy in here, right? I think I purchased the one with Walking Dead where Lori died because I wanted to have that. I really like that episode. Yeah. Dead. And I have like, um, fucking Rings of Akatan. I put certain ones I purchased Doctor Who. Fucking could always watch it, like Tom and the Doctor, and boom, I could watch it every fucking week. But it's like, but just imagine all of a sudden that shit just fucking vanishes from your account. Really? How do you feel about that? If like, I, okay, go ahead, Phil. Sorry. I'm saying that's like that's like that's like um, theft in a sense that they're stealing. So um, you bought something, you know, with in good favor with your own money, and yet they're, they're taking it away from you and stealing your money as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And that's yeah. not right. And you were left with nothing. Yep. And that's that not is true. wrong. They it's like the PlayStation. You're stealing your money at the same time. When you have PlayStation, like you have to pay every damn month for that, right? Right. If you get a, a free, free game with that package, right? If you don't pay for that PlayStation Plus thing every month, they take it away. You don't fucking have it anymore unless you pay for that. So you're paying for a fucking game for like four years ago, five years ago, like fucking rent. In it's a way. like, like, like nine ninety nine a month. Yeah, it's like what the banks used to do before they, before people made made enough stink about it. What they would used to do is if your account dropped below a certain amount, they'd start doxing your uh, your account. Try to keep right, it, and you don't have really. The problem seconds. is that would drop your account even lower, so they'd dox you even more, drops you even lower, and they and people started getting pissed off about that, and they stopped. Right. So I got to tell you, I will not ever do that again because I don't want them taking it away from me. That's not right. Yeah, no, it isn't. That's wrong. And That's thieving. That's absolute thievery right there. That is why I will always buy the physical copy. And I don't give a shit about the digital copy. Sorry. Right. So that that is that is that. Also, is that an actual practice now that they do it? Is it actually doing? Are they actually doing that now yes. these days? Yes. Yes. Wow. Yeah. You want to see the article? Let me get your article now. Yeah. I, I actually sent it to myself. Hold on. I'll actually read it. Hold on there. Yeah. Or I'll give it to you to read it if you want to read it. Okay. Yeah. Give it to me. And I'll read it as you as you go along. Okay. Oh, no, I know what you're going to do there. Okay, fine. No, Facebook is being stupid. Hold on a second. Yep, all right. It's taking forever. I don't I don't know what's up with Facebook lately, but okay. It's been all right with me for the last couple of days. It's been doing... It's been weird. Weird shit lately. Yeah. Okay. Ooh. What? Uh, free comic book day 2018. Avengers comic book uh, uh, 
Captain America number one, May 9th of uh, 2018. If you get Kindle, we're over that. Already. I know we just talked about it, but we got. No, but uh, we're in we're in September already. That's yeah, done. I know. Ah! I know, I know, but still, Lee. Eh? I felt good. Yeah, I got it. I'm having a read now. You can skim to it, yeah. And we'll, while you're doing that, I will get the next topic wonder story mm -hmm. that Philip will read. Sorry, it's coming out all fucking shitty because it's Google does all that stupid shit. Okay. All right, so what, what does it say about the Apple thing? Um, the Apple, right, it says here, well, basically it's telling us have you been ditching your physical media for uh, your physical library for digital one for major video, video on demand? Uh, library, well, think again because Twitter user and Anders G has found himself in a few stories today after he tweeted that he, he lost free digital movies bought on iTunes store in Canada. Free movies. Free movies that he bought. Through that. He bought three movies in good faith with his own money, and then it seems to me after a certain length of time, they were removed from his library because they're no longer viable. Years, years later, when they, they think you wouldn't notice. Ah, okay. It's a little scum, you know, that's screwed up. Yeah, it is. Yeah. Um, so we're going to continue. We're, gonna, we're not going to go into the next story because we had a time limit. I didn't realize that. So, okay, yeah, fair uh, again, if you buy the movie, it should be yours forever. Yes, it should be. If yeah. they don't let you have it forever, they're scamming and it's bullshit. Yes. And I would never buy again a friggin' digital copy or anything from that organization if that was the case. So would, just be wary. I may have to check my iTunes. I've got a couple of movies on there that I bought from them. I wonder if that's still viable. Mm. I am, I'm going to check mine now too. Because I, like I said, I bought stuff too. Which is not fair, by the way. Yeah. You know, if I could, if I could switch on my old uh, uh, iPad, I'd do the same. But now I can't even get it charged up. Because that's but that's really how do you, how do you take money from you and then and then they take it back? Why, why are they giving you the money back? That's bullshit. Yeah, because it it does say in this article that he did ask for a refund and they refused to do it. Right, but they don't they don't want him to speak though. So they're like, "Oh, we'll give you a free month of this. We'll give you free this. We'll give you free." You don't want that shit though. Yeah, no, yeah, they gave, you they don't gave, want that. No, no, screw you, man. Mm -hmm. No, that's bullshit. Honestly, yeah, I paid for my stuff. I want. My that, stuff. That's why I want. Why do you think I? I even with the comics, I will not get a digital copy. They take it away. I mean, all my shit on Kindle too, right? They could yeah. take all my fucking books off. And then I don't have them anymore. I mean, that's screwed up. I have um, Patrick Sness's thing on here. Because when he was uh, with, with class, I was getting his books yeah. on here. Yeah. And I was like, let me give him respect and get his works and shit. And then uh, I got my books on there. I got uh, some books on there and stuff. And that's, that would be really effed up. if um, I even got the 50th books on here. The Doctor Who... Um, stuff there's a peter davison one i got and you know i was supporting that way you know but i don't even know if they're there anymore i didn't even check my kindle in like ages bear in mind that this incident is that it's only in canada for now so for now it? though well, yeah now. yeah it's going to expand though I'm i've you. heard of it happening before somewhere else yeah so i know it's a thing it's a people thing. are going to be like you know, it was sort of like with the cell phones. You used to pay for the ringtones. And mm -hmm. then when you got a new phone, they pull pulling the shit that they don't want to make you have that ringtone anymore. Because like, oh, that's just for that device, which was bullshit. Remember? And you're yeah. like, well, why do I? Then, you know, and then nobody, everybody stopped buying ringtones. Because they're like, well, screw that. If, if I yeah. got a new freaking cell phone every six months or a year, I'm not paying for that same damn ringtone every freaking time. Exactly. That's how you can get you and shit. So... People are such greedy bastards. These organizations are just greedy, greedy, greedy. Um, I didn't even—I well, knew iPhone came out now. I didn't even get to look at that shit yet. <laughs> iPhone, what is it? iPhone X, X, what? Mega or some shit? Or I don't know. S or some shit. 
All I know is you've got, you've got to sell your house and your grandma to just, just to own one, to be honest. What, an iPhone? Yeah, they're very expensive. Or have a company that loves you so much that they'll <laughs> buy one for you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, In other words, do your um, job good. That's that's the thing. All right. So we're out of this segment, but we'll be back with another topic, wonders. Okay. Take care. Bye for now. Ciao.